Hey guys, this is Sarthak Masta from Cube Lelo and as you can see we have a totally disassembled cube over here and I'm going to quickly teach you how to assemble this cube in just a few steps. So let's get started. So for the first step we are going to make a cross on any face of the cube. We're going to choose white because simplicity so here we put in one piece this is pretty intuitive one piece over here the next piece we take this red and white one and put it next to the blue one like so Ma make sure to match this and this both and uh, the next piece we take the green and white one and we put it between the green and white centers and the fourth piece is the orange and white one and we put it between the orange and white centers and once you're done with this you might have a cube that looks just like this so for the next step we're gonna just put in the corners for the white base and we'll be done with the first layer after that so here are the white corners one over here second over here third over here and fourth over here put other pieces to the side and now let's put in these corners one by one so this is the orange and blue corner so we put it between the orange and blue centers like so and this is the orange and green one so we just put it between the orange and green centers now we have the white red and green ones so we put it between the red and green center and lastly we have the blue and red one so we put it between the blue and red centers and by the end of the step you might have a cube that looks just like this so for the next step we take out all the pieces that don't have yellow on them so for example this one this one this one and this one so these are the pieces to the middle layer of the cube or the second layer of the cube. So we're going to insert them one by one. This is the green and orange one. So we put it in between the green and orange centers like this. This is the orange and blue one. We put it between the orange and blue centers and then we repeat it for the other edges. This is the blue and red one. And finally, this is the red and green one. So we have solved two layers and by the end of the step our cube will look like this. So for the final step we are going to be working on the final layer of the 3x3 and let's start by putting in just one edge, any edge, just at one place. Okay, And then we either work clockwise or anti-clockwise and make the entire cube. So let's go clockwise. Uh, here we have the piece that goes adjacent to this on the left and then we need the yellow and blue edge to go next to this so you put that in like this and now we need a blue and yellow corner which is this one it has orange next to it so we take the orange and yellow piece and put it next to it okay and now that we have uh, six pieces over here arranged and we just have three pieces left we just put it align it to their specific centers and now we have three pieces left so make sure you don't stick in the edge first because it will be troublesome to stick in the corners after that so we're just going to put in the corners first. So this goes here and this goes here. For the last pieces, you might have some difficulty putting them in. So yes, this goes over here. And the, for the final edge, we put this over here, but it might be a bit difficult to slide this in over here. So what we do is we turn this 45 degrees and now when we do that, it easily slides in and now we have 
a completely assembled 3x3. So that's it for this video and I hope I'll see you guys again. Hit the like button if you found this video helpful, subscribe to our channel and turn on notification bell to get updated for future videos. Thanks for watching and happy QA.